The unit circle contains values for cos theta and sine theta only. The other four trigonometric ratios can be obtained using the identities below. Given angles from the first quadrant of the unit circle, find the exact values of secant theta and cosecant theta. In part A, we'll find the exact value of secant theta for the first quadrant angles. Secant theta is equivalent to 1 over cosine theta. We'll begin by finding the exact value of secant 0. Secant 0 is equal to 1 over cos 0. The cosine of 0 is equal to 1. One divided by one equals one. The exact value of secant zero is one. Now we'll find the exact value of secant pi over six. Secant pi over six is equal to one over cosine pi over six. The cosine of pi over 6 is equal to the square root of 3 over 2. Divide the fractions to get 2 over the square root of 3. Rationalize the denominator. Multiply the numerator and denominator by the square root of 3. The exact value of secant pi over 6 is 2 times the square root of 3 over 3. Now we'll find the exact value of secant pi over 4. Secant pi over 4 is equal to 1 over cosine pi over 4. The cosine of pi over 4 is equal to the square root of 2 over 2. Divide the fractions to get 2 over the square root of 2. Rationalize the denominator. Multiply the numerator and denominator by the square root of 2. This gives us 2 times the square root of 2 over 2. The twos cancel out. The exact value of secant pi over 4 is the square root of 2. Now we'll find the exact value of secant pi over 3. Secant pi over 3 is equal to 1 over cosine pi over 3. The cosine of pi over 3 is equal to 1 over 2. Divide the fractions. Multiply the numerator by the reciprocal of the denominator. The exact value of secant pi over 3 is 2. Now we'll find the exact value of secant pi over 2. Secant pi over 2 is equal to 1 over cosine pi over 2. The cosine of pi over 2 is equal to 0. One divided by 0 is undefined. The exact value of secant pi over 2 does not exist. We have now found all the secant ratios. In part b, we'll find the exact value of cosecant theta for the first quadrant angles. Cosecant theta is equivalent to 1 over sine theta. We'll begin by finding the exact value of cosecant 0.
cosecant 0 is equal to 1 over sine 0. The sine of 0 is equal to 0. One divided by zero is undefined. The exact value of cosecant zero does not exist. Now we'll find the exact value of cosecant pi over six. Cosecant pi over six is equal to one over sine of pi over six. The sine of pi over six is equal to one half. Divide the fractions. Multiply the numerator by the reciprocal of the denominator. This multiplies to two. The exact value of cosecant pi over six is two. Now we'll find the exact value of cosecant pi over four. Cosecant pi over four is equal to one over the sine of pi over four. The sine of pi over four is equal to the square root of two over two. Divide the fractions to get two over the square root of two. Rationalize the denominator. Multiply the numerator and denominator by the square root of two. This gives us two times the square root of two over two. The twos cancel out. The exact value of cosecant pi over four is the square root of two. Now we'll find the exact value of cosecant pi over three. Cosecant pi over three is equal to one over the sine of pi over three. The sine of pi over three is equal to the square root of three over two. Divide the fractions to get two over the square root of three. Rationalize the denominator. Multiply the numerator and denominator by the square root of three. The exact value of cosecant pi over three is two times the square root of three over three. Now we'll find the exact value of cosecant pi over two. Cosecant pi over two is equal to one over the sine of pi over two. The sine of pi over two is equal to one. One divided by one is equal to one. The exact value of cosecant pi over two is one. We have now found all the cosecant ratios.